In this video, we fly to Fukuok, stay at the Tonhai Hotel, and visit the night market in Fukuok that is known for its seafood. It's me and Bin. We're going to the airport now. It's raining outside. We're very late. There are very many similarities between Vietnam and Kenya, including timing and traffic. We are almost at the airport and Yang and her son and her mom are still at home because there are no taxis because of the rain. They've just made it. Okay, let's go. I misspelled uh, Yang's mom's name. Now this is a problem. Yeah, my name is uh, Lam Mi Chau. Yeah, not Chau Lam Mi. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's going to be okay because the bags are gone. Yeah. Look, look, look. <laughs> Yang is very stressed now. Are you okay though? Okay. Hungry. Good is on camera. <laughs> Never cut a flight so close. No, actually, that's not true. With Janal, I had to run onto the tarmac to get onto a plane. That was that was even closer, actually. On the bus. Yeah. Oh, finally. When My little entourage. All the receipt in front of you. Please avoid leaving your luggage in the aisle on your SS. Thank you for your cooperation. After a lot of drama, we were finally in the air and on our way to Fukuok. We had a plan to stay at a few hotels and enjoy the beach and eat a lot of seafood. I guess my, my luck keeps getting better and better. Who knew that there was a massive fishing shop right next to our hotel? Here's our room. We're near the night market. Fucking pretty decent. Clean as well. Very clean. Scratches. A decent TV, not that I want to use it. Oh, yes. The most important. Turn that shit down 17 degrees. Perfect. It's okay? It's okay. So we're going to the seafood market now. We're all very hungry. After almost missing our flight. Well, yes, here we are. Fukuok Night Market has a plethora of crazy things to eat, live seafood, and things you've probably never even seen before. It's a real street food paradise, with loads and loads of different drinks, shopping, and it's open most of the day, but actually it gets most exciting after 8 p.m. and closes around 11.30 p.m. Here you can see some of the live seafood, and a lot of mollusks, scallops, sea cucumbers, and all kinds of weird things. Sea urchin. So we have some prawns here and we have mantis shrimp, slipper lobster, a rock lobster, yeah, I got crab, 
$100 for one kilo. $100 for one kilo? Yeah. And how much is one like this? Uh, one point two, one three. Do I sleep a lobster? Huh? $50. Also, okay. You have a $500 grand? Yeah. Okay. I've never seen a country where so much ice is used. <laughs> I've drunk, I've had more water in the form of ice. Ice in every glass. Yes, and uh, everything is always ice cold. It's fantastic. What is this creation here? Get some of the extra special salt. Mix that in. Mantis shrimp, very scary like alien. I'm sure it's delicious. We had crab fried rice, chicken feet, mantis shrimp, and a fried shrimp basket with a salad inside, kind of like some tam, and there's some baked oysters. And yeah, those chicken feet were amazing. Look at that. <laughs> very delicious. As they say in Vietnam, Ngong Hoa. Mm. Yes, the mantis shrimp poised, ready to kill. Look at that mantis shrimp. <laughs> As sharp as hell. And they catch the fish, and then the fish is not getting out of that. I had to go to the toilet, it was flooded, but uh, yes, special experience. Yeah. So, yeah, the, our total came to $85, right? $85 for five people to eat seafood. We had half a kilo of mantis shrimp, and they're about $70 a kilo. The big lobsters, the normal lobsters, rocks lobsters are about a hundred dollars a kilo and each lobster is about 1.2, 1 kilo somewhere there. Uh, they even have shark but of course we didn't eat that and uh, yeah they have all kinds of things. Yeah, come visit Kukok. You want to film? slightly overcrowded and very non-private massage but which was actually quite good how do you feel i feel fantastic the massage place is very good i think after five minutes i fell asleep even before yang called me 10 times while i was sitting here and i didn't hear her because i was on another planet so yeah very very happy very happy i think now it's time to go back home join us in the next video where we try out the crown plaza fu kwok and explore the amazing beaches